you know what, man? You're no saint. You got a free cab. You got a nice free room. Oh, and someone will sit and listen to your boring stories. Didn't you notice on the plane, while you're sitting there jabbering on, I eventually started reading the vomit bag? I mean, doesn't that give you some kind of clue? Like, hey, maybe this guy's not interested in what I'm talking about. You know, not, not everything's an anecdote, okay? You, you choose things that are funny or interesting or mildly amusing. But you, you're a miracle. Your stories are none of those things. They're not even funny or amusing accidentally. Hey, honey, meet Dale Griffith. Oh, and by the way, here's a gun so you can blow your head off afterwards. Trust me, you'll thank me. You know, I, I could go to an insurance seminar and sit there and listen to him drone on for hours and days with a smile on my face. They say, how do you do it? I say, because I've been with Dale Griffith. They say, shower curtain guy? I say, yeah, I know what you mean. Whew. Yeah, it's like being on a date with a chatty Kathy doll. You know, I expected I'd like pull that string on your chest and it would snap back. Except you'd be the one pulling the string. Ah, ah, ah. You know, here's an idea. If you're going to tell a story, have a point. It makes it so much more interesting to the listener.